What's up YouTube, Marvin Four here with Great American Survival and in today's video we're going to be doing another side-by-side -side comparison of the Monster Bass subscription box and the Six Cents Premium Sack. Now both of these are February 2020. Hope you'll stick with us. I'll tell you all about it. This video is intended for all ages. So as we get started here, or <clears throat> as we get started, you'll see that both of these boxes both have a $35, roughly a $35 investment. Uh, both of them are right at a $50 return value. Uh, both are great boxes. This month, um, the Six Cents box came in another one of these little crushed velvet bags. And Monster Box is Monster Bass Box is still in a little cardboard box, but it does do the little fishing challenge. You know, when you flip it open, you get all this stuff in here, and you can submit your photos, post them online. That's all pretty cool. Uh, this month is the February 2020 box, and this is all the gear is supposedly here from Jason Christie and the Monster Bass Box. Very cool. Uh, these are inside the pamphlet you're looking at most of one of you're gonna get one of each of these if you're looking at the pro box from monster bass this six cents box is the premium super sack both of them are about the same last month I reviewed the basic monster bass box which is $20 value or $20 investment <coughs> And um, both of them are great boxes, but this month we stepped up, we went up to the $35 box to see what it was going to be like, got the Jason Christie box, and this is what we got. As you see, everything in here, the only thing I will say that was a negative is everything. When I went to price match and find the values on all this, every single item in this box is available, but I guess that could be a considered a positive, is available at Walmart or Walmart.com which makes it one it makes it a little easier if you're not looking at placing any massive online orders and you want to be able to go to your store and find out what you want to replace it it's cool to be able to just go to walmart pick up what you want and go down the road so this is the monster bass box we will start off with it and then i will bring in the six cents box and we will compare them. now the big thing i want you guys to do is at the end of this or as we go along i want you guys to tell me which box you'd rather have would you rather have the Monster Bass box? If you were putting in your 35 bucks, which one would you have rather had? Would you rather have the Six Cents box or the Monster Bass box? First off, we got a Booyah bait, a Booyah blade, from, which is a 3 8 spinner bait. Very nice, in all white. I like that, especially coming up into the spawning season. Nice, we got a Cotton Cordale medium diving crankbait. All white, even though even the uh, lip is white nice now this is a cotton cordell these are great um, if you haven't been fishing long you might not have used one but these things are great they work they catch fish hands down they, it's just that simple now they did throw in a pretty cool uh, Mountain Dew themed monster bass box sticker throw that on your kayak or your cooler whatever you were looking at we'll skip that we'll get to that when we get into the plastics we got a Hedden uh, Super Spook Junior in a bone color. What do they call it? Yeah, that's what they call it too. So that worked out good. Now this is a great little topwater plug. Works great for walking the dog. These things are great. Those catch fish. Everything in here is going to be in that category. This is the Booyah Hard Knocker. This is a lipless crankbait. I fish a lot of lipless crankbaits. This one is not an exception. This one is great. Uh, Booyah makes some great products. This one right here is a half ounce and it is in the yellow perch pattern. That's a pretty sharp looking crankbait. I like that. Uh, the next they throw in was a nice little Smithwick floating rattle and rogue jerkbait. Four and a half inches long, eight ounce weight, uh, one third ounce weight. Not bad. Not bad at all. 
This one they call black back or bell. Chrome chrome black back. Okay. That's a shark jerk bait. I bet you that thing will get some fish. Next thing we got, we got a pack of Daiichi hooks. Uh, offset wide gap, two aught hooks. Nice. I like the fact if you're going to give me plastics, give me some worm, got some hooks to use it. Got a pack of Yum Christy Craws in the watermelon candy. These are nice. I've used these. These have done very well. They do catch fish. And the last thing in the item is a bag of Yum Dinger. And this is an eight pack. The others, the Christy Craws were an eight pack also. So the Yum Dinger in the green pumpkin. Nice. If you don't know how to fish one of these, you can run it with the Daiichi hook or you can wacky rig it. These things, the stick baits, they catch fish. Especially in the colder weather when you're going for the finesse fish. Very nice. So, all in all, when I went in and price matched it, you were looking at $50 to buy each and every one of those items at Walmart.com. Not bad. Boop, bump my tripod. Now, so everybody says, you know, hands down, that's a great box. They put together some nice stuff. Now we do have a card telling us what we're getting in the Sixth Sense box. Now I do say I will be very happy to admit I'm very I'm much happier with the Sixth Sense box now that I'm that I've been getting because they're thrown in their soft plastics. They've gotten into the Divine Shaky Head worms. They've got packs of hooks in there. They've got a little bit of everything now. They've really stepped up the game. And I think it's a game changer for them to be able to offer their customers much better products. Uh, we're going to start off with a Crush. What is that? A Crush 50X. That is a two foot, two to six foot diver, two to five foot diver Crush 50X. Nice. That's a nice pattern. That's the one thing that stands out about these Six Sense lures is the, the, the way they paint them. Man, they're just sharp. And that one is in the Thule Perch. Nice. Uh, next, we have a Divine Hydro Jig. Nice looking swim jig. Three eighths. They call this the Delta Craw. That's a nice looking lure. I like a good swim jig. Um, I live in Georgia, so swim jigs come in really handy. Take these little wrappers out. Now, this is cool. Because this one, I actually looked at Academy and almost bought one of these because of the color. Um, our here in Georgia, it rained almost all of February, and it was our water's just been caught like chocolate milk everywhere you go because it's just rain, rain, rain. Um, dark baits like this are going to come in handy. This one right here is the Swank 77X in Black Magic. Now that is a this is more like a wake bait. This is nice. This isn't like a regular square bill where it's just going to only dive down a little bit. It's a weight bait. Because I've got one of the other ones. Here, put that one over there. Oh, wow. This is a really cool hybrid. This is the swim crank. Dives um, just below the water, zero to one foot. And this is a sharp looking bait. Look at that thing. Uh, neon sunfish. That's nice. I like that. Five eighths ounce. Next, we have a square bill crankbait, which is a movement 80x, which is a one to three foot diver, and is three eighths ounce. And this one's a chartreuse spank. That's a nice looking lure. Their square bills are great. They catch fish, especially the wake baits. I've caught some big stuff on the wake baits. I do like their little vat, their little bags that they give us. Next is one of their newer items, the Sixth Sense Shaky Head Worm, Green Pumpkin Burst, the 10 pack. That's nice. And then they've got some of the Sixth Sense new, let's see, four odd, five pack of their offset wide gap hook. Oh, these are just wide gaps. That's a nice looking little hook. So, guys, if you were looking at these, which one do you like better? Do you think the six cents box would be a better investment for your 35 bucks? Or do you like the Monster Bass box? Comment down below and let me know. Before I forget, our winner from last month's subscription box giveaway, 
for the live stream was AOK -okay Outdoors. They will be getting the two rod sleeves. So if you're watching this video, um, I think the name is Thack. Thack, give me a, give me a email, shoot me an email, give me your address, and I'll have those shipped out to you ASAP. And thank you guys for being part of the live stream we did last month. This one right here, I think they're both incredible boxes, and I think they cover a wide spectrum. Well, that's the boxes. That's the two boxes that they sent out for this month. That's the Monster Bass box and the Six Cents box. Which one would you rather have? If you were putting your hard-earned money into the box, which one would you rather have? Comment down below. Those comments are what I'm going to use to get, do my random giveaway. And guys, thank you so much for being part of this. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're new to our channel, crush that subscribe button and hit us a like button. And also make sure you check us out on social media. We're on Facebook and on Instagram. And we are also looking at launching an online fishing forum where we're going to be doing a monthly fishing challenge where we want you guys to post your videos and your pictures. Guys, let me know what you guys think. Check us out on Facebook. And guys, have a great week. We will talk to you later. And guys, remember to get out there. Enjoy yourself. Enjoy nature. Be prepared. Stay safe. God bless, guys. We'll see you soon.